The second use to which microorganisms are made are, let's say, making bread. So when you make bread, there are various things that one uses, like the flour, sugar, salt, water, yeast. The yeast is a microorganism. So what happens is that you, as you mix all of them, you know, you would have seen how people would do the flour. So as you start doing, I mean, this is basically the hand of a person who is doing the doing of the mixture of all these things. So what happens when you make bread is that this yeast cell reacts with sugar and the sugar is converted into carbon dioxide plus alcohol okay so then what happens is that as the quantity of carbon dioxide keeps on increasing the dough also keeps on increasing in shape right because of which what happens is that you know initially when you would have mixed all this it would have been kind of a little tough have you ever done the work of doing may not be but next time when your mother is doing it just have a look at it so as this carbon dioxide increases this becomes spongy why because the air starts increasing and it increases in size okay then basically once this is done this dough is baked okay and when this is baked at a particular temperature which is normally around 180 degrees centigrade the yeast cell is killed okay and fermentation is stopped at 180 degree the fermentation stops now what is fermentation just in case for those of you who do not know when the sugar is converted into acid conversion of sugar into acid okay stroke alcohol when the yeast cell which is basically your microorganism react on it through microorganism is known as fermentation so at 180 degree basically the yeast are killed this process of sugar converting into carbon dioxide and alcohol is stopped and this will keep on this will stop expanding okay and the breads are formed that's why if you see a piece of bread you know this there are little little spores here or there in this entire bread piece why does that happen because the yeast when it starts reacting with sugar expands it so whatever let's say this much the, this much material was there it will kind of keep on increasing keep on increasing once it reaches 180 degree it will stop why stop because these yeasts are killed so there is no more reaction on sugar it will stop and the bread is done how about the alcohol is it that the alcohol will remain in the bread no because this alcohol basically evaporates as you reach 180 degree 